The honor code is etched in stone right on West Point's campus. A cadet will not lie, cheat, steal, or tolerate those who do. Now the U.S. Military Academy is publicly trying to explain one of the largest violations of that code in its history. 73 cadets are accused of cheating in a final exam last May. All except one were in their first year at West Point. The exam in calculus was given remotely. Two cadets have since been cleared. Four have left the academy. 59 have confessed to cheating. Eight have denied being involved. Congresswoman Jackie Speer, who sits on the House Armed Services Committee, wants answers from the taxpayer-funded academy. We're finding out about it from the media. Uh, that would suggest a lack of transparency. It would also suggest a cover-up. USA Today, which first broke the story, reports the cadets involved all made the same mistake on the same part of the test. Most of the students who admitted to cheating are now part of a six-month rehabilitation program and will be on probation until they graduate. In a statement, West Point called the situation disappointing, adding the honors process is working as expected. NBC News military analyst Colonel Jack Jacobs, who teaches at West Point, says there is time for the cadets to learn from this. By the time they're graduated, uh, they're going to be uh, uh, the best people we can find anywhere. Officials say the honor code was violated by a number of cadets. This is the largest cheating scandal at West Point since 1976, when more than 150 upperclassmen were expelled or resigned after cheating on an engineering exam. Now, more than 40 years later, another black eye for an institution that prides itself in instilling honor. I think anyone that doesn't recognize that this is uh, such an important opportunity that they feel that it's okay to cheat doesn't belong at the academy. And Steph, uh, West Point isn't by itself not the only school to be hit by a cheating scandal during the pandemic, right? No, it's not, Hoda. You know, a lot of students are taking their exams remotely. Reportedly, Texas A&M is investigating cheating. University of Missouri reportedly caught 150 students cheating. That temptation of taking an exam at home or somewhere else unmonitored, proving perhaps a bit too much for some students. Back to you guys. All right, Stephanie uh, Gosk. Stephanie, thank you so much.